This video is going to be a quick tutorial on how to free up storage on your Samsung phone. So this is going to work on all Samsung phones and let's get straight into it. The first thing you have to do is open settings on your phone and then search for storage. Then select the first option that's storage and here we can see how much of our storage is being used. As you can see it's 87% and then they've also given a breakdown of where the storage has been used. So for me, the three main areas are images, videos, and apps. So now we're going to try and free up space in these three things. Additionally, Samsung analyzes your storage and suggests ways how you can free up space. So I'm going to show you all of this in this video. So let's get started. So the first thing you should do is empty your recycle bin. So to empty this, just scroll down. Then under recycle bin, just go to each app. So I'll go to gallery. After that, I'll select all of these by long pressing on them and then click on delete all at the bottom right. The same way, do it for all the other recycle bins which are over here. And this is usually a place where a lot of storage is used up. After that, scroll down and we'll go to unused apps. So click on this. So these are the apps which you don't use much and they're arranged with the largest app on top. So this is a place where you can really free up space so just select the apps which you'd want to uninstall. So let's say I want to uninstall these. On top you can see the amount of space I'm going to free up which is 1.4 GB and then to uninstall it I'll click on uninstall that's at the bottom and then click on uninstall again. After this duplicate files are another great way to free up space. Just click on it then here you can see all of your duplicate files. So all you have to do is select one of them since we already have two and once you've selected them just click on delete that's at the bottom right and click on delete again. Then we can delete large files so if you click on this here you can see all of the files and they're arranged with the largest one on top. So as you can see the top two are over 900 MB and the size keeps reducing. So this is one of the best ways to free up space so you can just select the ones that you don't want. So let's say I've selected these and I want to delete it. As you can see, I'll free up 5.2 GB of space and now to delete it, I'll click on delete and then move to recycle bin. And after this, we'll again have to free up our recycle bin. So these were the four easiest methods to free up space since most of the work was done by Samsung. And now there are a few more things which we can do from our end to clear up more space. So in this breakdown of storage, just select the options which are the highest for you. So usually for everyone, apps will be taking a lot of space. So I'll click on this. So now these are the apps which are taking a lot of space. And the best thing which you could do is uninstall some of them which you don't use. But I'm sure many of them you can't uninstall such as WhatsApp or Spotify or anything like that. So then what we can do is clear the cache storage in each app. So this may take some time, but once it's done, you'll see the results. So I'll quickly show you how to do this. So let's say I want to clear the cache in Spotify. I'll select Spotify, then scroll down and click on storage. And here you can see that the cache is taking up 151 MB. So all I have to do is click on clear cache that's at the bottom right, and it's done. So no data of yours will be lost but we've just freed up 151 MB of space. So you'll have to follow the same method for all other apps. This may take five to 10 minutes, but once it's done, at least three to four GB of space will be freed up. After this, just go to the other places where a lot of storage is being used. So for me, it's images and videos. So again, I'll click on images and here it'll show me all the images. And if you find some which you can delete, if it's some album or WhatsApp images, then just go there and delete it from here. The same thing for videos, just click on this. Then here you'll find all of your videos. So you should just continue this process. And one thing you should make sure is that your recycle bin is freed up after this. So these are the ways to clean up space. And I've tried to keep this short and simple. And let me know if this helps. Goodbye.